Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and to another video. Today's video is going to be a food haul and everything that we buy as a family of three in a week. Our, our shop this week is from Lidl. We generally shop from Lidl and then buy other bits um, as we needed, but this shop is just from Lidl um, this week. And uh, this week we spent £60, so it's sort of a um, budget friendly sort of weekly food shop. Um, I just wanted to talk through you, um, literally I've just put everything away um, now, so I just wanted to talk through you um, our meal plans for the week. So generally what I do is I write um, a list here of everything we're having in a week. Um, so generally I just put the dinners um, for the week that we're having um, and then some maybe some um, breakfast ideas and something if I want to do and um, make a lunch. Um, so dinners this week are a, a lentil curry um, for Monday. Um, Tuesday is going to be cheesy broccoli pasta bake. Um, we're trying to sneak some broccoli into Amelia as much as we can. Um, and then Wednesday is going to be fish cakes. Um, again, a really nice one um, to make. Um, Thursdays is going to be a slow cooker beef stew. Um, so a real hearty meal. We all love that in this family. Um, Fridays is going to be a vegetable shepherd's pie. Um, Saturday is a slow cooker vegetable tagine. And then on Sunday, we're actually eating at my parents, so we're going for a roast. Um, so I haven't included that in our weekly shop this week, but um, generally we'll have a roast on a Sunday anyway or something similar. Um, just some different breakfast ideas. Um, uh, the days I've left blank, Amelia's at nursery, so she has breakfast there. So just to try and keep it different and not the same every day for her, I try to write it down. Um, so I've got here on Wednesday that she's off of us porridge and toppings, Friday toast and cereal, Saturday pancakes and Sunday eggs on toast. So just to keep it like interesting for her and not the same thing every day. Um, and then this week as well I'm, I'm going to be making a broccoli and stilton soup. Um, so that one I've just popped there and hopefully that will last me a few days for lunches which is great. Um, so that is basically our, um, our sort of like recipes for the week. Um, I will pop all the recipes below as well so that you can click on the links and um, use the recipes that we use because they're very yummy. Right, now I'm going to show you everything in the food hall that we bought this week. So the first, so first recipe of the week we're making is a slow cooker vegetable tagine recipe. Um, this one's actually from the Tesco website. So what I'll do, guys, is I'll uh, link all the recipes that I've got down below. Um, so if you want to make it too, you can. Um, so for this, this week we have bought um, some dried apricots. We need an onion, um, some couscous. So we buy these packets just because they're super super easy and quick to use so we've got the um, roasted vegetable couscous and the sun-dried um tomato and garlic couscous um we also need is a pack of tomatoes obviously we don't need all of these for the meals so these could be spread out for other meals as well when needed um an aubergine um a courgette some sweet potatoes um one a carton of passata and a chickpeas um so this is a new meal for us this week. We've not tried this one before, so I'll definitely let you know how it turns out. And then we're also going to be making a, a vegetable um, shepherd's pie. So for this, we're going to use some of the corn mints. Again, this is the bigger pack, so we won't need the whole pack. Um, a carrot, potatoes, parsnips, um, a vegetable stock pot as well for that. Um, I've put them all here. Actually, they all use... Um, a lot of our recipes this week use the vegetable stock pot. So I've got a, pack, a bigger pack here of a four. Um, but I will be using these throughout all the, all of the meals this week. Um, and then next up is the lentil chilli. So for this one, I we really had these lentils. So I just wanted to get out to show you the lentils that we use. Um, so we've got some lentils there. Um, some light soy sauce. Some mixed beans. 
um, a pepper, a lime and an onion and then a fajita mix pack as well. Um, so that's another meal for the week. Um, as well as that, we're going to be doing um, like a slow cooker uh, stew. So for that, we've picked up some of the lean Aberdeen Angus lean diced minced beef. Um, we're going to be doing some sweet mash with that. Um, we're going to be throwing in some carrots and some parsnips with that as well. So that's another really sort of like hearty meal. I know we all love that one, especially on a cold day. Um, next up, we're going to be doing some fish cakes. Um, so we've picked up some hake fillets um, for those. Um, and we're going to be popping that with some sweet potatoes and, and then probably adding some um, veg on the side of that meal. Um, so we all really, really like that one in this family. Um, a nice, really, really quick, easy one um, is we're going to be doing a broccoli, a cheesy broccoli pasta. Um, so we've got some pasta and um, some penne pasta um, some broccoli and um, some cheese. Um, this is obviously a lot of broccoli. I'm hoping this week that I'll be able to make uh, broccoli and stilton soup from the leftover stilton from Christmas. Um, so I'm going to be using some broccoli for that as well. Um, so there are main meals for the week. Um, some other things we've got in the freezer already. We've got some frozen burgers um, and things like that. So we're going to be using those up as well. Um, these are just spares. We've got lots of onions, um, lemons and limes. And then some other sort of cupboard bits that, that we needed. We've got curry powder. Um, another pack of chickpeas. A couple of cans of soup. We really like these minty lamb chunky soups. Um, some breadcrumbs. We've got here's some um, squash, some sort of high juice. <clears throat> and we've got some um, lime and elderflower sparkling fruit. We've got obviously some milk for the week, uh, a couple of cereals. So we've gone for the Maycorn Pecan Crisp. And we've gone for the apricot wheats. We've got a carton of orange juice. Um, we've got some unsalted butter and some olive spread there as well, and a can of clear honey. Um, some of the snacks we've got this week are these really, really nice sweet chilli rice crackers and some crisps. I really, really like these ones, so just uh, various flavours of those. Um, and uh, some soft cheese as well. Um, Fruit-wise, we've got bananas. They're just really, really good for breakfasts. Um, or in pancakes or just on their own. Um, Amelia really loves these uh, green apples at the moment. So we've got a pack of green apples. We've got two pears and a mango. And we've also got um, some raspberries and some black seedless grapes. Um, a little bit of a treat in the little bakery. So we've got some of their bakery items in there. Um, and then as I said, we have some burgers in the freezer. So we've got some burger buns there and then just a few um cleaning supplies um obviously some sponges foil some bleach and some washing up tablets so that is absolutely everything on this week's shop thank you so much for watching and i really hope that's given you some inspiration um, for your uh, food meals this week. Um, please do leave some comments below for some inspiration for myself. If you've got some great recipes that you want to leave, um, that would be amazing. I'd love reading um, different recipes and what you might come up with. I personally love videos like this, so I hope you did as well. So please do um, like and subscribe to um, my, my channel if you did. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in my next video.